At this museum in San Francisco, artists have imagined a future where artificial intelligence says sorry for killing most of humanity. It's not meant as a joke, but a warning. It's a really amazing technology. It's also really terrifying. Now a long list of tech scholars and experts are saying the same. Billionaire Elon Musk, along with co-founders of Apple, Skype and Pinterest and others, writing bluntly in an open letter, AI systems with human competitive intelligence can pose profound risks to society and humanity. What do you see as the worst case scenario here? Well, the, the worst case scenario is obviously that we humans gradually lose more and more control over our, our civilization. They're urging developers to consider a six-month pause in the enhancement of AI technology that can create human-like responses to user prompts like ChatGPT and Google's bot known as BARD to ensure proper oversight and planning. The reason we want to avoid these sort of dire outcomes is because we want to realize the positive potential that the technology has to offer. One risk is the ever-improving code will allow computers to outsmart humans and flood the world with mistruths, like this viral fake picture of Pope Francis in a puffy jacket, or those photos falsely showing Donald Trump being arrested. We need to have legislation that says this content was generated by AI. Innovation Minister François-Philippe Champagne insists the government's data privacy bill, which still needs to be passed, will regulate AI. It sure does. Easier so said than done, says this expert. Once it develops emergent personality, it becomes autonomous and effectively becomes uncontrollable. We asked ChatGPT about the future and it sought to reassure us. I am designed to assist humans, it says, and not to replace them. Thomas Dagg, CBC News, Toronto.